Here comes the bull. 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 All right, boom crew. Um, I'm heading out. You won't be able to see my outfit like that. Uh, I'm gonna record my whole outfit later. Um. So this is my face. I did my lashes. You know, I draw my eyebrows and my old trusty rusty red lipstick. I have a long, long lace front on and I tried to finesse it the best I could. I know that now that I'm looking at it, I should have cut the lace a little bit more. Um, but further than that, it looks good. Um, I think I did a good job, but you you can see the lace a little bit. Um, I do have a wig grip on, so hopefully that'll stop my... Um, wig from going back i did want to do a uh get ready with me but i'm in a rush and i don't I, I can't be worried about um recording myself getting ready but i am layered up i have one of those cheapy um spandex on that i'll be getting from them spots with the stripes on the side long socks I do have uh, something to hold my stomach in a little bit because i'm getting my period for the second time this month um <sighs> What else do I have on? A hoodie, and I have this small jacket on that I found in my house somewhere. And I have a scarf one under that, this scarf. So I should be good um, in regards to being cold. My legs might be a little cold, but um, I think I should be all right. So anyways, guys, I'll be back to show you guys my full outfit and everything when I get there. It might be a little hectic, and I'll try to record as much as I could. Okay? Oh. How you feeling so far? I'm okay. Oh, you put sorry in quotations. It's the cutest thing ever. Let me write it down. It's our neighbors. That's the bar. For Instagram? Yeah, for both. Because for YouTube, then horizontal, for Instagram, vertical. No, I've been doing vertical for uh, YouTube. Ew. <laughs> Why? It's easier for when I'm, when I'm vlogging, I have to hold the phone. It's easier for me. Get yourself a, a stick. It's like $10. Don't you have the nasty bars on the side? Yeah. No. I hate vertical, but vertical is fun I know to play. Vertical is fun to play. I got now I feel like I was talking shit about vertical, but now I kinda like it for latte art for Instagram. Right. Because you can play around with it and be creative with it. It's just not good for filming people. Like, I don't want to see your legs, I wanna see your torso and up. Beautiful stuff. Look at that. Look how shiny it is. Super, super shiny. Sparkling. I wonder if that's too bright. I have an idea. I'm a speed ramp. Yeah, that's what I wanted. So guys, anyways, I'm getting ready. We got a videographer here, Justin. Say hi, Justin. Hola. <laughs> so we're just getting a, a preview of my setup. I just want to see how it looks. 
I know the lighting is kind of weird. Oh. Hold on. So guys, um, the event is going to start soon. I lost my whole, sorry I'm looking in the mirror guys. I lost my whole pocketbook, my wallet, my debit card. I had took some cash out of the ATMs like I have changed for people. I lost it. Um, I'm trying to keep it together. I've been through a lot just to do this showcase. And I'm just not having a good day. I don't want to say that out loud, but it's, I'm not having a good day. But um, I'm trying to keep a smile on my face so I can get this stuff over with. Hopefully I'll make some sales. I'm not sure how uh, me taking money or me doing transactions are gonna go. I lost everything, my driver's license, my credit card, my um, debit card, my favorite lipstick. Uh, I have my house keys on me. I lost my phone charger, I hope my phone doesn't die. I'm just, I'm stressed the fuck out right now. But anyway, um, I'm gonna try to keep it together and put some water on my face and try to calm myself down. I locked my cards and everything, but it's just one, one, the, 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 the best day to lose my shit. It doesn't make any sense, you know. But this is my hair. I tried to do my baby hair. Uh, it looks decent. This is my outfit. Let me see if y'all can see my outfit. That's my hair. Hold on. Sorry if the camera's all shaky and stuff, guys. But yeah, that's what I'm looking like right now. Got my big old boots on. I'm fitting right in with these crazy ass white girls. I'll be back, guys. This thing has to go on till 11 o'clock, and my battery is on 60 some, 60 percent or something like that. And I optimized the battery and all that extra shit. But I think that's a gimmick. You think that really helps? Or they like, oh, optimize, close this app. I don't think so. <laughs> I noticed. I did that with my phone. My phone's gonna last for me a while. Oh my god! I it says, it says oh. And I turned off authority brightness. I turned off the NFC. Oh, you did it? Yeah. Oh, wait. All those things suck. You. This is why iPhones die so. Please, Justin. It's already recording, I think. Is it? Uh huh. I'm cold. Cause I'm sitting right by the door. <laughs> I love flowers. Like, flowers. I love flowers. <laughs>
Why would you try to hide? Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is one of yours. <laughs> hey, Justin. How was the weirdos? How was the partying with weirdos? They said she said she went upstairs. And then yeah, we so it, it, it was wicked. It was I real. Was right I was at the window. It was our game game. Oh. You didn't go you didn't stay upstairs? Oh, okay. Listen. He said it was weird too. I would have been mad. No, it was very awkward. Was dark and people were just standing around. Yeah. And, and they was doing performance. And the performance was like <laughs> I need to get you off camera. Shout out to the boys. Shout out to the boys. I just want you to wait. Come on, my legs. All right, so I got you. Up there and they doing all this. <laughs> and then when the beat drops, it's like. <laughs> no, don't, don't do that to my friend. Don't you think I'm lying? I'm gonna fuck. So like cringe, like get me the fuck out of here, buddy. Karima was like, I'm ready. I was like, okay, we can go. I'm like, wait, wait, wait I just want to see. I'm glad they have you some of that. First of all, I think Karima is mad super weird. I don't think she's super weird, but she's weirder than me. Why you say that? She, she, she watches my channel. That's great. <laughs> I love Karima. She knows I know she's weird. But my thing is, for, for Karima to say that it's time for us to go. It's time for us to go. Oh, that's a fact. It's time for us to go. That's a fact. No, but they was really up there like on some... Hi. I can't say high-tech fucking anything. They was just like, oh, they was smoking that weed that is isn't exactly weed. And then that guy with that fucking... That thing. I was like, oh, it's time for us to go. He was like... And he had this skeleton thing. He would have scared my face. Oh, my God. He would have been so fucking petrified. He was like, no. Then they was like, soon as we... Soon as we were like, it's time for us to go. The beat dropped in. I looked over. There's one girl in red, one girl in white. What the hell? Is that me? They had a fucking nun with a fucking mask on. And I'm not religious, but my thing is, I don't believe in devil shit either. Okay. They wild and wild. That's what they was doing upstairs. They were doing some crazy, crazy. Yeah. I don't want to know fuck nobody. Okay? Nasty. This is too much. Anyways. We on our way home, y'all. It it's over the river through the fucking woods. Right? Oh, Nigga done ran with yeah, the yeah, shit the boots. <laughs> what are those? <laughs> we lit or not? I don't we care, y'all. I was That's comfortable the whole you day. Say, no, say no. it to the camera so my uh, subscribers can get you. They're they gonna be like, she cute, but why she taking my chest up? <laughs> no. <laughs> Guys, these are the flowers that my friend Karima brought me at my showcase. I put them in a Dunkin' Donuts cup. <laughs> I'm using the other vases that I got, so whatever. But I want to give you guys a recap of the night. I'm sorry, uh, but I need to give you a recap. So, basically, oh, I look so fucking greasy. God damn, it's because of that flash, y'all. I promise I don't know. This greasy, the flash is glimmering off my fucking. My hair look all crazy now. Because <laughs> I had the hat on and everything. Oh my god. I look a hot mess. 
Anyways, guys, I'm exhausted. I am upset. I lost my pocket. I left my pocketbook on the train. Now, before the show started, um, like even before the show, my mood was kind of off. <laughs> I left my pocketbook on the train. I had withdrew money so I could have change for people who buy my bag. The money was taken out apparently. The precinct called me and said that somebody bring the bag to them. So I have to go to that precinct and get my bag. I'm thankful that they got they they returned the bag, but here's the gag. Oh, I have to wipe these down. Look at all of that. So here's the gag. I locked my credit card and I uh, requested a, a replacement because I didn't want to wait. I requested, I reported my debit card lost and stolen. Um, so I have to, um, what you call it? What? I'm sorry I'm taking long, y'all, but I, I'm, I'm fucking, I'm, I'm upset, I'm mad, I'm tired, I'm grateful, I'm going through a whole bunch of emotions at once. So long story short, I locked my credit card and my debit card. Those are my two forms of money. My credit card I use just in case of an emergency, so I carry it with me just in case I needed to use it today. So, for the next 7 to 10 days, I have absolutely no money with the exception of what I sold at the show. And that stuck on an app because I had to cancel out the debit card that I had linked to that app. If I, I, I've never in my life felt so many different emotions. I'm glad that the person brought my purse back. I'm mad that they took the money out, but realistically, it's like, you know, not many people would have returned the money in everything else. I locked my car because I wanted to make sure that nobody uses whatever I have on it. But that's my last unemployment check on that card. And my credit card was supposed to hold me over until well, um, this job that I've been offered until I start the training for that job. But I'm not sure when I'm going to start the training. So I'm saying all that I have to say this. I'm broke, broke. Um, I'm going to see what I could do tomorrow. I'm going to see what I could do about getting some money. I'm just, I don't want to, want it to be where I can't buy groceries next week or something like that. You know, I, I need, I need for at least to be able to come home and have groceries and stuff in the house. Now, I do not, I don't have welfare or nothing like that. So, this is all me. This is all me on a fucking budget. Like, this shit is hard. And then I didn't make, and I made one sale at the show from someone that I know. Um, I had a lot of people come up to me, ask me for a card, ask me do I do custom, said they love my work. But most of the people that was in that show was selling prints. And it was just like, I didn't see anybody else selling bags at this show, y'all. I was literally the only one selling bags at this show. And I felt kind of out of place because I'm like, is this even my show? Everybody in there is doing photography and selling prints. So, I don't know, guys. I don't know. Usually when things get really bad like this, that means that things are about to pick up. 
And I really hope that they pick up because I have not been having a good week. I am stressed the fuck out. And I'm trying to hold it together. But. Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, look at my lipstick. I did not reapply it not one time today. And it's still on. And that was one of the things that I was worried about when I left my bag. I was like, lipstick. Well, hopefully everything is in there with the exception of the money. I know they took that, but whatever. Good night, guys. Thank I don't know why I got the flash on. Yeah, I'm going to hold them now. Um, I'm trying to pick up my purse from this place. It turns out uh, the officer who told me to pick it up from a police service area is not a precinct because I just saw a cop and I was like, oh, do you know what a precinct is over here? She's like on 119th or whatever. I'm like, 119th? Like the officer that called me said is on 221 East 123rd. So I guess they got a little service station over here. I'm off to go there. I'll be back. I'll let y'all know how it goes. Everything was in here except for my money. Um, I had a Bank of America card, but I probably didn't have it in here. Um, so, <clears throat> fucked up thing is, I had to cut all my cards off, and I don't have any cash on hand, and I have to wait till they mail out. My card, so I'm really. I have no fucking money. None. And I don't know what the fuck this is. But this ain't mine. This is not mine. It was in the bag, but. I don't know who the hell this belongs to. Maybe they just put it in there because it was in the room next to my stuff. I don't know. But, um, why I'm in the, why, why I'm in the, um, the precinct waiting for them to give me my stuff, right? <laughs> Sorry if I look washed out, guys. I'm waiting for them to give me my stuff. And why do you need to talk about nothing? Not nothing. Nothing. Coming. Ejaculating. They talking about um some drinking ginseng and all that. And they in there talking about busting a fucking lunch. I was like, that's ridiculous, yo. That's a, that is ridiculous. And the other officer even tried to warn him, like, hey, be careful. We have somebody here. Um, I said, that's New York for you. I mean, that's not New York. That's police officer for you. Anyways. This is bittersweet because I don't have to go replace my uh, driver's license. Um, but my cars are deactivated. I'm broke. Uh, my money is gone. The, the cash that I did have is gone. And I don't see my... Uh, oh. I don't see my health insurance card in here. 
So I need to find that because people could use your health insurance card and commit uh, medical fraud. So, um, and a lot of these places do not be checking to see if it's yours or not. They just. Anyway. I turned this damn TV down and turned itself back up. No lie. Um, I need a mental break. I'm tired. I'm hungry. I'm going to go in there and find something to cook. Oh, I don't know how people wear wigs long term because that shit sitting on your edges. Oh, my God. And I had a wig cap on and some other wig grip shit on. Sleep, but I'm tired. It's 11 o'clock at night. Me and the cat just sitting here looking at each other. <laughs> Being weird. I said I wasn't going to do absolutely nothing today, and that's exactly what I did. Nothing. I ain't going to the gym. I ain't going to therapy. Nothing. I wanted to be in my feelings at my house and just sit down. So, yeah. That's the cat. And that's me. And I'm about to take my ass to bed. <sighs> and tomorrow's a new day. I'm supposed to get a shot in my shoulder tomorrow, so we'll see how that goes.